this whole like using other people's money. That's great in theory, but I do private lending. There's no chance that if you can't show me some sort of credibility, I'm going to give you my money. So, you know, even from then, I do remember, you know, that whole using other people's money strategy that wasn't like something that I even thought was a viable option. Like, yeah, okay, fine. That's potentially a viable option, but how the am I going to get your money? I haven't proven you any kind of credit. I haven't, Mm. I haven't done anything to justify you giving me, you know, what a hundred thousand dollars. Like who's going to do that? You know? So all these young kids, I think that, you know, the, the whole OPM thing is like a, is like a a viable option. Like show me you deserve it and show me that I'm not going to lose my money. You better show me some sort of proven track record. Mm. You know what I mean? And if you can't, that just kind of shows me that you have no credibility. I think that, I think that using other people's money is a dangerous game. And I also think that it's something that more seasoned investors and seasoned flippers or whatever that, you know, would go in and, and use that kind of strategy that that should be a strategy only for after you've accomplished something or I, or at least have something to show for it yeah. or even more important, you had better have some sort of collateral to cover a shortfall or if things go sideways because there's no way that someone's going to give you your money. There's no way. If you want to see more, subscribe to my YouTube channel and follow me on social media.